If you see it in your mind, you can hold it in your hand. Make a choice. You just decide what it's going to be, who you're going to be, how you're going to do it. Just decide. You attract what you feel, what you are, what's on your mind. Picture everything you want so clearly in your mind until you can see it right in front of you. Write it all down on a piece of paper. Create a vision board. Then you will have evidence in the future. Evidence of the amazing power of your mind. The amazing power of you. Every thought we think and every word we speak is creating our future. It's as though our thoughts go out into the universe and are accepted and brought back to us as experience. Like there's a, there's a, a redemptive power that making a choice has, you know, rather than feeling like you're at a effect to all the things that are happening. Make a choice, right? You just decide what it's going to be, who you're going to be, how you're going to do it. Just decide. And then from that point, the universe is going to get out your way. Once you accept it, then you can start deliberately creating what you want in your life. So let me share some of the concepts that have helped keep me on my game. So the first one is like attracts like. You have to understand, you are a magnet. Whatever you are, that's what you draw to you. If you're negative, you're going to draw negativity. You're positive, you draw positive. You're a kind person, more people are kind to you. So you're like a magnet, you know, and you got to understand something about like attracts like. If you see it in your mind, you can hold it in your hand. This is so true. You've got to grab this. You've got to create dream boards. You've got to put the new car up on your mirror. Put the weight you want to be on the refrigerator. If you can see it in your mind, you can hold it in your hand. Well, I mean, positively or negative. I mean, you attract. No, you're not, not just what you fear. You attract what you feel, what you are, what's yeah, on your mind. Yes, yeah, it's, yeah, it's like exactly. the law of physics. I don't know how anybody can disagree with that. It's, 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 ask any physicist, they'll tell you. Like, it's true. The total believer. Yeah, I believe in uh, manifestation. I believe in uh, putting a rocket of desire out into the universe. And, and you get it when you believe it. You get it when you believe you have it. And that's the key is like people still, they sit around going, when's it going to come? 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 And that's the wrong way. You're, you're facing the wrong way, you're facing away from it. You have to go, it's here, it's here, it's here. See, most of us just think, 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 and we don't pay any attention to what we're thinking. We're just doing it. But that's a, something you need to train yourself to do. You begin to train yourself to be aware of what you're thinking. Key word that you use in here over and over and over again in every chapter is that in order to attract or manifest anything, you have to be in alignment with your source. With your with source. source. With God. With you God. have to be yeah, it's about you have to stay connected to the ocean. That's right. Yeah. You, you can't just sit around and wish yeah. for stuff. It's our intention. Our intention is everything. Nothing happens on this planet without it. Not one single thing has ever been accomplished without intention. All of us have within us this amazing capacity to manifest and attract anything that we want into our life. Ask, believe, receive. So many people overlook this very simple quality. You don't have to figure it out. That's what freezes people. When you're trying to figure out your life all the way to the end, when you can't figure it out, it freezes you from trying it because you go, oh, well, I can't figure that out. Oh, I can't go over there because I don't know how. You don't have to know how. You have to ask, believe, and receive. That's as simple as it gets, folks. It's very, very true. I really want you to understand that. Now, science says, show me and I'll believe. Faith says, believe and I'll show you. I want to represent possibilities. I want to represent the idea that you really can make what you want. An insane belief in my own ability to manifest things, you know, that I think it's ultimately complete sanity, but I believe we're creators and I believe we'll create with every thought and every word is every moment is pregnant with the next moment of your life. I, I believe that I can create whatever I want to create. If I can put, put my head on it right, study it, learn the patterns, and I feel very strongly that we are who we choose to be. Well. 
what I experienced in my life is that when I really wanted something, I always got it, positive and negative. Because the universe does not think, you know? You have this subconscious mind attracting bad things, you know? Because you want to be a victim. Because to be a victim is to justify a lot of uh, frustrations and right. failures in your life. The universe is helping you. You want to be successful. The universe is helping you. Every time you think a thought and every time you speak a word, you are literally painting your future, uh, making your dinner, uh, whatever you want to call it. You are creating and you're creating your own life.